for me, I have um, always a contract with the customer. In that contract states the tasks that are asked from me. Um, and I put also the time in there that I think I need for all those tasks. So as said before, I work uh, when it's virtual, one hour a week is my minimum and four hours per week is my maximum. Uh, but I have a lot of customers who only need me like four hours a month. That's also possible. That's indicated in that contract. And I have blocks and I, in my, in my weekly calendar, I have blocks. I put them in there and the customers know when I work for them. So they need to be ready for me um, by that time. And they send all their emails or all their tasks by the, the, the block, the, the date that I put in my, my diary. And then when I'm done, I um, indicate via email or via WhatsApp that everything that was in the inbox is done. And maybe I spend less time than they thought I would, and that's good for them. But maybe I spend more time, but then I indicate very transparent. Like this week, I uh, worked uh, two hours or two hours and a half instead of two or one. Uh, one time I had a customer who wasn't happy. Um, she gave me a list of, I think, 50 emails per week. And I only could work two hours per week for her. So I indicated the two hours are done and I finished ABC, but D and E are still on there, but the time is up. And then she said, yeah, I want to have task D and E also finished. Then I charged her three hours for that week. And then she wasn't happy because we indicated two hours per week. So transparency and communication is very key. And, and as a customer, you need to realize the time is needed for those tasks. So when I start an assignment, I always say, make a list of all the tasks you want to delegate and put ne next to the task, the time that you spend now on that job. Then you have an indication on how much time we would need for it, but normally we are more efficient and we work faster because we're used to all those tasks. But when you spend now five hours on making invoices, then it should be logic that we invoice four hours or five hours for that one, but not ten.